Tat McNamara, always good to see you. Good to see you too, man. Super 32 action going on. Yeah. Uh, how, tell me, uh, how many guys you bring out? We brought two guys out from our club. Yeah. Two guys? Yep. Yeah. How are they doing? They're doing pretty good. We had one just lose, uh, kind of in the blood round there. Oh. Close match, and then one won in the blood round, so we got one guy's doing well placing, and the other one wrestled great and just kind of came up short at the end of the match, so it's good though. Gotcha. Yeah. What, what do you think of the tournament? What's it take to place in this match? I mean, getting yeah. in the blood rounds. Yeah, it's pretty, brutal. Pretty it's, it's amazing how, how the level of competition. You know, so many coin flip matches, they could go either way. You know, so many close matches. So you got to be good in the top and bottom position to win matches out here. It's really, so, really important. Sound like you're talking about college wrestling. No doubt about it. No doubt about it. A lot of these kids are the future college wrestlers. So it's fun to see their, their progress and them getting better every time they come out. So. What do you think of like, what's it take first of all to, to win or place high at this tournament? Just like you said, dress on top and bottom. Yeah, it takes a lot of a lot of commitment first. Commitment from the family, commitment from the kids, the ability to put in the hours it takes to be ready for an event like this, you know? You have a lot of kids come out to this event, but there's only a few that are really ready for this event. And uh, Justin you see it this round. Mexico, Matt it's fun to see Justin what, Wood what uh, separates them. And, and I think the biggest position that separates them is the top and bottom position. You know, you see, if you can't get away, you're going to have a hard time winning a big match. So. It's hard to be a top level high school wrestler or, you know, to, to compete. Like, what's it? Are the days of like the four month wrestler? You know, wrestling season wrestler over. I don't know if that's the case. I, I think I think it depends on the individual, depends on their focus and and their level of commitment. You know, I, I think you know you definitely can't be a four month wrestler, but you could do other things. You could play other sports and still be able to participate. But you're gonna have to put some time in in the off season. There's no doubt about it. And it, whether you're wrestling the whole time or not, you're gonna have to put some time to continue to develop, to continue to improve, you know, throughout the year, for sure. Gotcha. Tell me, uh, you guys have, like, a philosophy at Edwardsville? You stretch, like, what, yeah. what, are you, what are you hoping that kids get out of, out of the club? Well, we want them to enjoy the sport. We want them to fall in love with the sport. We want them to be fans of the sport when they're done. You know, we want to create a bunch of kids that really like the sport of wrestling. That's first. And then... We want them to develop and, and continue to improve when they're in there, every time they're in there, and, and enjoy what they're doing. And, uh, and, and a lot of enjoying what you're doing is having success. So you got to continue to put the building blocks in place and continue to improve each and every time you're in, in the practice room, for sure. Nice. Uh, where, uh, where can people find some more information or come check out the club? Yeah, uh, we're at www.edwardsvillewrestling.com. So, and uh, we have a, a off-season program called Quest Wrestling as well. Nice. The facility. How many? How many no. years ago was it? Yeah. that I came out there. It's ten there? years ago now. That was not ten years ten ago. Ten years ago. It's oh hard to believe. God. Yeah. yeah. Um, it's a. It's an awesome. It's a special place. Yeah. Sure. Has it? Let's say it looked amazing. It, it, yeah. it, is it as good as it, it felt like whenever we came? Through? Oh, it's better. Yeah. It's it's amazing. You know, we have an awesome space for kids to come and and work hard and improve and develop and 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 fall in love with the sport of wrestling, which is awesome. Oh, sweet. Well, what, December 3rd, your guys can yeah. watch some amazing wrestling, right? Spates is hosting yeah. a tournament. Yeah. Arizona State. I yeah. talked to Prince last night. He said their top team oh. is coming to compete. Arizona State's got a lot of tough kids. No yeah. about it. So I guess one more question. What, uh, what do kids get out of watching that level of competition, oh. just being able to sit and watch? Yeah, it's, it's huge for kids to see what they want to aspire to be you know they got to put the work in and understand that that Brandon next level Powell, is a big deal and they're going to have to work Powell, extremely Richard hard to get there so it's fun to see it it's fun to see the teams and and the effort put in, into every match that goes on for sure awesome always good to see you pat good to see you too thanks man yeah